what I tell you about breathing? Through your mouth, in rhythm with your steps. Siri, cut it out. Anything to say for yourself, young lady? I'm very sorry, Uncle Vesemir. Young blood craves action, I understand that. But when you fight a beast, knowledge counts as much as your silver sword. At the very least, you ought to be able to tell a ghoul from an owl ghoul. By markings, like unto the Panthera tigris that in Zeracania dwells and by the sickly paleness of its visage. Mm. So you did read the chapter. Still, you should have asked if... But you were asleep, Uncle Vesemir. So you did the reading. Why not admit it right off? Never pounce on an advantage as soon as it appears. Wait till it stands to have maximum effect. Uncle Vesemir's words. Well, you're a quick study. Quick, but mischievous. Fine, we've talked enough. Geralt, you're with me, Lambert with Eskel, Siri with a dummy. Again? Stop groaning and grab a sword. What do you think? Should we start by reviewing the fundamentals, or go right to free training? Should work on the basics. Even skilled masters need to hone the fundamentals, and Ciri's barely a novice. Draw your sword, Geralt! Ah! Quick cut! One, two, three! Strong Good strikes again. now. Give it all you got! Tar. Never lock your elbow when striking, young lady. Showing off, Geralt. Ah. Strong blow? Position, Siri. Footwork. Remember. Not bad. I think I'm 
Now, parry. Siri, see how Geralt holds his sword, its angle. Come on, at them! Stop showing off, Geralt. 